And that's the finished product. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Here is everything that comes inside the box. It comes with a user manual, and these are the handles where you hold on to the machine when you stand up. Here are the other poles that make the exerciser stand up, and the machine uses a three-prong cord. They give you an aux cord, a screwdriver, and some screws, and they also provide two resistant band handles. And when you open the box more, you'll see the motherboard. Here is a stand of the motherboard, and we'll show you how to connect that later. And finally, you have the platform, which you stand on when using it. And that is everything inside the box. After unboxing it, the first thing to do is get the platform and look on the back of it and unscrew all four of these screws using the provided screwdriver. Next, we're going to put this here. So make sure that this one right here, guys, you put it on this one right here. Is there a pair, right? You see here, come at the back. So this is your indicator, guys, that this is for here. Because there are one, two, three, four holes. And one, two, three, four for your screws. So there's like three prong right there. And all you have to do is just shove it in. There. Now, I'm gonna shoot it now. Careful. Be so really, really careful. Boom. So it will look like this. Now, I'm gonna put the screw, okay? Screw back the bolts that was unscrewed earlier. Yes, good! Now let's look at the front side. All right, guys, so it looks like this now. Now we're going to proceed here. So we are on the left side. And we are going to unscrew these screws and insert one of the poles in here. All right, guys, so next step, we're going to put the armrest or like a handle. So like this, guys, there's like a bent right here. So this one, the bent is inward. So not like that, but inward. So now we'll start from the bottom right here. So make sure guys, these two holes will match this right here, okay? So you're really obliged to take it out to shoot it. And you see the hole, you need to match them perfectly. And you screw your screw. After tightening both screws, your bent pole should look like this. So now we're gonna install these handle right here, okay? So make sure guys that these two holes will match your holes there where the screw is. But you need to loosen the screw and exactly the same on the other side. For a better view, this is one of the handles where you hold on to the machine when you stand up. So now you shoot that here, right? Make sure and just put your screw back do exactly the same on the other side. After screwing these bolts tightly, your machine should look like this so far. Okay, so now we're gonna do exactly the same on, on the, the other right side. side. So this time, it's on the right side of the machine. Unscrew the bolts, insert the pole inward, screw the bolts back in, grab the other handle, unscrew the screws, insert the handle to the holes, put the screws back in, tighten the bolts, and now your machine should look like this so far. Okay, now the next step is to unscrew these two bolts, and let's start with the one on the right side. The goal here is to align the holes together so that you can insert the bolt and tighten it. And just be careful to not damage any wires while you're tightening these bolts because you obviously want this to actually work when this is installed. Okay, now we're gonna go on the other side. So first, let's take this out and make sure guys not to drop this guy. You better hold that. You need to loosen this screw. Okay, so it looks like that. Now you can untangle this. Because I think they just tangled that so it will not drop there. You know what I'm saying? So just temporarily, we'll hook it down here. Now. So now you do the same thing on this side. Align the two holes together, insert the screw, and tighten the screw. So just tighten it. Okay, there you go. Okay, so now we're going to put the board. But make sure, guys, that the word pin T is facing to you. So make sure white to white, black to black, okay? So let's start from the white, this one, to this white here, okay? okay. So white on the machine, and there's a white one yeah, coming on both, from the both, bottom. Yeah, both handles. So just insert. Okay. 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 Now you get the black from here. Then you connect it here. This and here. There. Look like that. And then now you can drop them inside. I'll put this bag up here. Okay, now it looks like that, guys, right? So now we're gonna place this one, two, and there's one in front. Mm -hmm. So first you need to loosen this screw here. Then loosen on the other side. Like that. Now loosen the front cord. 
Okay, so it looks like that. Now you will just shoot the hole here, hole there, the three hole to here. So make sure there's washer and screw. Okay, do the other side. Then I have the third one. So the third one is here and then here. That one. So just tighten it, okay? It will look like that. Tighten the screw with the provided hex wrench as needed, and this is what the machine should look like so far. Now, guys, we're going to put this here, the back. Come on, bro. Now, ready to plug it in. You could start using it right now if you really wanted to, but if you want to use the resistant bands, then you should install them first. Now, guys, we're going to install this. This one for there, for here. They have this two thing here, this one. What you're gonna do is just go outside here, Let's start here. Hand tight it and then use the provided tool to tighten it as much as possible. And now you pretty much do the exact same thing on the other side. Finally, get the ends of the resistant bands and hook up both of them on each side. And now the only thing left to do is to turn it on and make sure that it works. And that's the finished product. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Check the current pricing in the description below if you want this exercise machine for yourself. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next item.